So PlayStation has Spider-Man and Wolverine as comic book base exclusive. What is Xbox gonna do? What's up y'all, hoping everything's well, hoping everything's doing fine. So PlayStation recently announced a Spider-Man 2 and Wolverine game exclusive to the PlayStation 5 console and it's being made by Insomniac. So the thing with Insomniac, you know the games are gonna come out great, amazing. Spider-Man for the PS4, amazing. Miles Morales, I played, I dabbled in it a bit, I was loving it. And I have the utmost respect and confidence in Insomniac that they're gonna deliver two more amazing games. And even before the Spider-Man game came out for PS4, I've just been scratching my head wondering, why isn't Xbox coming out with a comic-based exclusive game? There's so many things they can do. So in this video, I wanna talk about that. But before I do, please like, subscribe, comment down below, share the video, and hit that notification bell. So there's a few ways Xbox can go with this. They can do another Marvel comic hero, or what I would like to see from them, maybe tackle something from DC. Who knows, I feel like maybe Flash. Flash might be a bit difficult. I don't know how they would navigate, you know, the high speed. Or, but I would just love for them to do like a DC, like a Green Arrow. I think a Green Arrow game will be amazing. He's human, and it, I just think that would be an amazing thing. Or even one of their villains, I feel like Deathstroke would be amazing to work with as well. But in terms of like DC heroes, I would like to see like a Green Arrow. And we know like something like Batman and Superman is gonna is a huge draw, so that'll sell well. But I would like I would like them to try to give you know other DC heroes some some spotlight. Like I said, Green Arrow would be awesome. There's a lot of stuff they can do with Green Arrow. Beside DC Comics, they can tackle a Spawn game. Oh my, I can't even remember the last, the last Spawn game I played was for PlayStation 1. And I don't even remember how many years ago that was. And it's just, it's amazing to me how nobody has tried to come up with a new Spawn game. I, I mean, even for Soul Calibur 2, I believe, Spawn was an exclusive character on the OG Xbox. And it's just like, come on, like, Xbox, make a Spawn game. That'll be insane. Like, I would just love to see more Spawn. I, like, I'm, I'm not a mega Spawn fan, but I really, really like Spawn. I loved the movie as a kid. I like the comic. I love the games. And at that time, even though the game, I'm pretty sure if I play it now, I'm like, why did I even like this? But at that age, I was just playing any game. I liked every game. Like, it was hard for me to not like a game. And, um... I just had so much fun and it's just that character is so amazing like that's probably one of the best comic book based characters it's just so much so many so much different stories you can get into and just the abilities he has and it's just an amazing thing to do like a mature rated spawn game as an xbox exclusive sounds amazing I, honestly it doesn't even have to be an xbox exclusive if anybody makes a spawn game even if it's playstation i don't care i would just love to play as Spawn. I feel like that's a major thing Xbox can do. And I really hope they are listening to us fans and they're taking this into consideration because that would be an amazing idea. And I know a lot of people would want it and would want to get an Xbox for it. Another comic book based game that they can make. And I, I'm just, this is another one. This is the main one where I'm just like scratching my head. Why hasn't anybody done this? The Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Can you just picture like a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game in the Arkham City style? Like that would be amazing. Like Rocksteady making a TMNT game. Like can you imagine how great that would be? It won't be, since it's owned by Nickelodeon, it won't be rated M for Mature. But even even then, I don't even think the Batman games are rated M. I'm not too sure. But um, just a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles game. Like an open world. It can be, it can have some co-op aspects to it but i would like um mainly single player but i also don't want it to be like the avengers like an rpg type thing i just want it like i mentioned an arkham city style tmnt game that game just the thought of it gets me so excited like maybe being able to switch out players leveling up you know michelangelo leonardo damtello just leveling them up separately or maybe as you play as one and level one up they all like get their not level up i, I don't want to say it like that because it makes it sound more like an rpg but as you, you know, unlock new abilities for your character, each of the turtles get their own abilities upgraded as well. And 
I don't know, it just, it's insane to me how that hasn't come up yet. And I, I feel like Xbox is the perfect console to have an exclusive TMNT game in the style of like an Arkham City. And it's just, I don't understand, like, they must have had some kind of conversation. Because for me, it's too obvious. Like, you need this. Like, you need a comic-based exclusive game to compete with what PlayStation has going on. Like, because you know, well, you already know, PlayStation is going to have some banger exclusive, top-tier exclusives. And we know Xbox has a lot of that coming on the horizon with um, Horizon 5 and um, Halo and other games. But, like, in this comic book space... This is where they're lacking, where, you know, at PlayStation has Spider-Man, Wolverine. Spider-Man, one of the most popular superheroes of all time, if not the most popular. And it's just for me, TMNT is not as popular as Spider-Man, but it'll be huge. To me, it's a no-brainer. At least, Xbox, if you're listening to this, which I doubt, just have the talk. Just think about it. Come on. TMNT, open-world TMNT game with some co-op aspects. You know, Xbox is a great place for multiplayer games. This will be an amazing thing to have as an Xbox player and as a TMNT fan. Like, just think about it, please. I rambled on quite a bit there, but I, I'm just so passionate about this idea of these games possibly coming to Xbox. And I really want to know in the comment section below, do you guys think Xbox needs a comic-based exclusive game to compete with what PlayStation 5 has going on? If so, what comic book characters would you like to see as an Xbox exclusive game? And if you don't agree, why not? Please let me know down below. Please share, like this video. If you didn't like it, all good. Hit the dislike. I'm going to catch you guys in the next video. Thank you once more and take care.